History Wes, and welcome to the Greenhouse SMP Patreon server for Steena Rose Gaming. We are here in the middle of the Nether uh, Hub today, and we are doing a little work in the Nether. We have a transportation system here that's not being utilized, really. But anyway, uh, my hallway is just up ahead. And if you've noticed an increase in the quality of the video, that is because I'm playing on my new computer. I got a brand new 2019 Mac and I'm playing Minecraft on it. And I'm going to uh, take some time here and finish up this little hallway. I bought this new Mac. I've been uh, planning to get a new one for a long time because my old one was from 2012 and was uh, pretty slow although it still ran and I bought the uh, newest one the ninth generation i5 I bought it with uh, 8 gigabytes of RAM but I expanded it to 40 right away and it's got a 1 terabyte solid state drive and Radeon 580X graphics with 8 gigabytes of graphic memory so Minecraft looks super awesome turned up all the way with all the fancy settings and the render distance up around 40 to 50 uh, no slowdown no nothing however all is not well in uh, Minecraft land at my house because for some reason I cannot get the OBS settings to sync up when I recorded this earlier I tried to start with the video with OBS and uh, it's all jumpy and laggy and I've spent hours and hours fiddling with the settings trying all the tutorials on YouTube and no such luck so I'm recording this with QuickTime and then I've or I have recorded it already and now I'm doing a voiceover which is kind of a pain and it uh, takes us out of the moment but uh, fortunately this is more of a building thing instead of an action adventure. A lot of people will bust uh, my chops for gaming with a Mac anyway and my answer is uh, I don't just game with my computer. I use it for other things especially writing. I'm very picky about crashes and backups and ease of use. I used a PC for many many years, gamed on it, great gaming, lots more games available than for the Mac, but uh, since I mostly just play Minecraft anymore, one or two other games like Civilization, very rarely, uh, this works fine for me and I don't have to worry about all of my uh, writing, my outlines, my uh, plot synopsis, synopses, uh, all disappearing in a, some kind of a blue screen of death, which I had way too many of. Um, let me give you an example of just how easy this is. When I got this computer home, I set it up, I connected it by a network cable to my old computer and I ran a little program that's in every Mac called Migration Assistant and it copied everything over and I don't just mean my files it copied every app over as well uh, I didn't have to reinstall a single program I did have to reauthorize Microsoft Office which took about a minute and one other program but everything else was copied and ready to go even the junk that I had sitting on my desktop was all ready to go. So it was super easy. You just turn it on and it works, as Steve Jobs would say. Anyway, I really do love this uh, beautiful 5K 27 inch screen. Uh, I'm kind of finding it difficult to play with because it's so large. Uh, I've experimented playing in Windows. Uh, rather than full screen because I always played full screen on my other computer it was a 21 and a half inch but anyway this hallway that I'm putting in here is uh, a new addition to my own little personal nether hub 
here in the greenhouse and it's not a fancy one it is a very simple pathway and it leads uh, to the west edge of my base on the greenhouse SMP we have a base that stretches a radius of 300 blocks from wherever central point you pick so this is 300 blocks out and at right at the edge of my base limit is this little town so I've decided to kind of um, take it over and redo it and you can see I've done this building here this house replacing the um, cobblestone with white wool I didn't do an Asian style roof but um, I think that's okay on some of the houses they don't all have to have that kind of a uh, uh, tilted up corners uh, I'll need to completely rework these buildings this was a library the books are all gone and we've already raided long ago the, the blacksmith there but these little square huts will work really well I think for pagodas and then we'll be able to come over here and we'll trade with this leather worker and this guy back here who thinks he's a farmer but he's really a fisherman I'd rather he sold coal because I'm not selling him any of my coal. It's too precious. The actual line for my base, the edge of the base, is right about where Chowko the dog is sitting. The um, portal is inside my base and the village is a little bit outside, but I don't think anybody will mind. Um, we have a very small community and there are very few people on uh, at any particular time. I think the three most active members are myself and my two offspring, my son and my daughter. Uh, and they're not on right now either, so it's just me. So I'm going through the portal here to uh, the fortress. Inside the fortress on the upper second level up. This is uh, Super Smelter. And we'll go right outside. I just want to take a look around and appreciate the beauty of my base. Looking at it from my new computer. Just really, really happy that I can turn all the settings up to fancy and all the resolution up as high as I want, 5K resolution. Although I think I've only got 1920 by 1024 right now. But there's our house over there and the Temple Pagoda. And our farms. The warehouse. And then there's the waterfront, which we're going to expand on. The library over this way. And we've got our floating lanterns. And there's Morrow the Wolf God overseeing everything. And here we have our two fortresses. The one behind me is actually a mob dropper, mob spawner. I guess mob dropper is a better term. Waste not, what not, get that uh, experience. I got attacked by creepers there. I should say I was surprised by creepers. I'm the one who did the attacking, really. That was in my first go around at recording this morning which ended up being unusably jumpy uh, crap. So, over the hill here we have our Irontown inspired uh, underground build. I'm going to do something else to it to fix it up, make it look a little better, although it's uh, pretty realistic to its original source material, which is uh, the Studio Ghibli movie Princess Mononoke, as is uh, Mara the Wolf God up on the hill there. And now we'll take our back walkway. And this goes out the south part of the base. 
I don't know why there's a floating block there. I haven't been by this way in a while. It wasn't me. Okay, here we have our gate. And I want to make more paths out of the base and more of these uh, beautiful Japanese style uh, entrance and exit gates. And this little path takes us right over the hill here uh, to the community farm. And you can tell all the trees there. This community farm was built by, and designed by Stina Rose, uh, who is the uh, owner of this server. This is a Patreon server, so supporters of Stina Rose Gaming who uh, support her at the $10 a month level have access to this, as well as her Discord and other uh, cool things, as well as uh, just helping out and supporting uh, a really fantastic Minecraft content producer. So I'll leave some information in the uh, info below down by the comment area. Please feel free to leave a comment. And uh, if you'd like to uh, become a Patreon, patron, you should, and uh, join us here on this server. Okay, we're back in our little village here. We're going to have to think of a name. Um, uh, uh, there's a problem that you have in Minecraft all the time, falling in a hole. Fortunately, this one doesn't seem to be connected to any underground danger areas. I'll have to fill that in after I get this tree. Anyway, we need to think of a town for this. Maybe Kobe or Kyoto. I like those names for Japanese towns because, you know, they really are names of Japanese towns. Alright, now I won't fall in here anymore. And done and done. Alright, so we're just going to uh, turn this little house into kind of a pagoda. We're going to take off these extra logs at the top, which we can put to use. What we'll do is we'll put a roof at each level, make it three levels high. We'll do that using these spruce slabs, and we will go out um, a distance of two on all sides and then we'll upturn the corners. This is more of a test of concept than anything else. Let's see if it looks okay. I have a feeling that you can only do so much with these uh, tiny little constructions here. but. Uh, there's our fisherman diligently planting. He really thinks he's a farmer. Okay, so as I said, we want to go out a distance of two. Yep, keep going. And the one piece in the corner there will upturn. We're just going to use spruce wood, uh, and since we have cobblestone as a foundation at the bottom, we might do some uh, little uh, cobblestone extras to kind of set off the build a little bit. Okay, now to upturn our corners, what we have to do is place a block, a temporary block there that down and then take that back up and we'll do that at each corner easy squeezy that's not how you say it. it's easy peasy okay so I said Kobe or 
Kyoto. If you have an idea for a town, it doesn't have to be a Japanese, but uh, a name that uh, fits our uh, area, you can uh, leave it in the comments. It would be greatly appreciated. All right, so now we build up our second level. And it's going to match our first level. Let's see, that was three blocks high, not counting the ceiling and the foundation. So we'll go four here, it should match up okay. There we go. And just fill that in. This is four by three or uh, five by three, right? Let's see. Yeah, five by th five by four. Okay, so the front and the back are not going to have windows because they're uh, only two blocks between the pillars. So we'll have a window on either side, and then we'll have a path right there, which will lead down with a uh, ladder. Okay, we've got our second level completed. And we're going to do our roof the same way that we did on the level before. And here, we're going to fill that in as indicated. Oh, Candy Bear is on. Candy Bear 5947 is one of the moderating mod team. Um, I'm not technically, I'm not sure what her technical title is. She is uh, the official moderator on here or not, but she is definitely one of the people who keeps the server going. And a really great person and a great minecrafter great builder in her own right um, i think i'll leave a link to her channel down in the description you can check her out In fact, she's part of a husband and wife, I believe they're married, husband and wife duo that uh, like to play around with some, some experiments and redstone and other stuff that's kind of fun to watch. Okay, so... One more row on this side. You know what would have been real handy if I had a handful of ender pearls here. I should go to the end and pick some up. We don't have an ender ender on this server yet, but we do have. Um, easy access to the end. We have killed the dragon a couple of times and um, so getting a few ender pearls won't be a problem. Okay here we are on the third level up and we are making another uh, roof This one is not going to be quite so wide. We'll just go out one block from the edge. But we will do the same type of roof. And uh, since I think we have, uh, we're at the top half of the block. So when I chop it, 
the whole block goes. But so if there's one extra step you got to replace the block. But other than that, it's fine. Bing bang boom. Okay. Now I want to make a little bit of a slope in the middle here and with this tiny roof there's not too much uh, to do. So I'm just going to lay out before like this and then go too wide with a little thing here. And since we can't do half slabs we'll put uh, some cobblestone stairs in the middle to kind of top it off there. There we go. So we have kind of an interesting roof. And you can see it's kind of dull on the front side because there's no windows. Go around here to the side. And okay, there we go. Okay, we've got our proof of concept. So next time we'll do something a little more exciting. If you've enjoyed this video, please press like and think about subscribing. And as always, keep on Minecrafting.